welcome to this video and today I'm going to be showing you my soft plastics. Um, if you didn't see that first part, I've got tons of soft plastics. Not really compared to other YouTubers or anything, but I'm going to be showing you every single package. I keep them in these packages, yum packages. This one's in um, just a zip-up bag because there's so much, but Zoom, Powerbait, any package I could get my hands on, Striking, Yum, but I'm going to be going through every single one of them here and showing you what I've got. So first off, I got the plastic Senkos. The container's broken, I can't zip it back up, but I'll show you I've got these silver and white Senkos, but they got stained by these red ones here, which it kind of looks like a dying shad looking thing because of the white bleeding shad. So that's pretty cool. And I also got these uh, bluish, tan, navy ish color. Don't really know the name of it. I got them in a dinger. They call dingers, but the color is. Yeah, this is the Pearl Slam. This is what this one's called. Pearl. Pearl Lamb. Smoke Pearl Lamb. That's what these called. Five inch Senkos. Um, all of them are five inch. I'm pretty sure I got all of them from Yum. But yeah, I've got all of them in containers. I got this one over here. I'm not sure. So next we're going to move on to this one. Got this little piece on it. Um, it's in a Dinger package, but I've got these. Don't really know the name of them. Curly tail worms. But I got these for. I got a whole bunch of these for like a dollar. I got a whole bunch of other stuff for a dollar, and this was in it. Um, I'll get a better one. I can't really see the color popping right off of it, but I'm telling you guys, um, I've caught fish on this. I've caught fish on these right here. Um, they're pretty nice. I just got them for a dollar, so I'm not sure that they're quality, but I've lost, I caught three fish, then I finally lost it, but, um, so three fish is not bad for how much I have. I don't actually have a lot, but got pretty few for, last me around 30 fish. But then we got into this mystery bag. Um, what's in this mystery bag is mystery. <laughs> I just put a lot of my soft plastics that I don't use. This one's ripped. Uh, I got this um, little trailer, circle, circle tail, whatever you call these, um, slugs, these, swim baits, tubes, craws, <laughs> I'm not sure if you would call this like a craw, it looks like one, but it is one, but, and these, no, I could use these as a black and blue trailer they're pretty sick um i got a lot of stuff in there um lizards uh, i got a lot in there sorry for that guys um next i got these power worms but i think they're these power worms that's in this i got a hundred pack i put one in here for Slimmer package, so um, I don't really have to carry this around. But I've got these here. They're not the best color way, but you could rig it up in a lot of ways. I'm just looking at the ways you could rig it up: drop shot, weightless rigged, Carolina whack, wacky, shaky head rig. Just a lot of ways you could do a Texas rig. I forgot about that one. I usually Texas rig these. Um, yeah. So there's this, and then I got some in here. These are some different colors, like orange and red, like pumpkin. So then I've already gone through a lot, and it's only been four minutes. So I got these flutes here, baby shad, or baby bass, guys. I'm sorry, baby bass looking things. Um, I've also got different colors. These little gray ones. I'll get one out here for you guys. Let's get the two types I have in here. I've actually got three types, but I've got these white looking long swim thing. I don't know. Look at these tails. I've got that tail. Kind of looks like a dolphin tail. 
Um, then I got these smaller um, gray ones here. Yeah, those are, I don't really use those, but then these, these right here, these are the ones I love to use. These look like baby bass. Um, I just love them. I don't really fish them a lot, but if I fish a fluke, um, those will run out before any of the other colors because I use them so much. I don't use them, but out of the fluke category. The next, trick worms. Um, big package for long trick worms. Some of them aren't as long, some of them are longer. But I think these are the ones that this package came in. Watermelon seed. Wacky rig it. Don't think I've never Texas rig it. Doesn't say. Um, I've never heard of Texas rigging one of these. Sorry for my dog, but um, got that color. Got a darker color. Don't really know the name. Shorter. This seems like a five inch one. Um, you could wacky rig this. That'd be perfect. I might start using trick worms a little bit more, but I think that's it. I got a lot of those. I like this color. The greenish watermelon color. I like the watermelon color for almost all my soft plastics. But don't use these as much as the other ones. But curly tail worms. I, that's what I call them. I don't know what they're really called. But me and my friends call them power worms, curly tail worms. Um, sorry for that, guys. And I just realized the camera, my phone, flipped to the other side. So if you see a little bit of a different angle. But... The lighting's a bit different, but the camera fell, so I had to change it. Next, I've got these Havoc Crawls. Um, I know they're backwards, most likely. Like, this is my left hand. Yeah, I don't know. But I've got these Havoc Crawls. I've got Claws in here. I've got... I've only got one of these candy pumpkin things. I need to get more of them. I had more. Don't know where they really went. I only use them as trailers for jigs, but I only use cars for trailers. That's all I use them for. Um, never fished or caught a f fish. I fished a craw without just being a trailer, but I never caught anything on them. I've only fished it for like five seconds. Next, we've got this package here. Um, I think what's in here. Is water beetles? I think this is what they're called. Um, this is the different package, so I can't really tell. But I'm guessing they're water beetles. I don't think so. It's kind of got things on it. I kind of look like it, so you could use this as Carolina rig. Let's see, weightless, Texas, Carolina, all the normal rigs. So this is what these look like. All the same color. Only have a few of these. I actually, got quite a lot for what came through it. But use it as a trailer. I've never even used it as a trailer, but who knows? I might try it. I'm gonna, I might be doing a video trailer challenge. That won't be the name. It sounds really stupid, but get all my things. Try to use them as trailers. Not all of my soft plastics. So there's a lot. Like use a crawl. Easy. I get that done. Use these as a trailer. And I got a few more coming up. Next, guys, we got this yum package here, guys. Can you tell what's in there? These little centipede things that are long as heck. I'm gonna trim it because, guys, okay. I wanna show you how long this is. It's not even stretched right now. Not even stretched. That's how long it is. Um, I'm gonna trim it just a little bit because it's gonna be way too long for a trailer. The fish are just gonna nip right here. Not even get close to the hook. But I'm going to be using this as a trailer. Never even fished it. Never even left my house. Um, of course, they're in a Yum Dinger package because I love the Yum Dingers. Cheap, easy rip. But sorry, for, I think the finish. But next, I got these Power Bait Worms. Um, I think some of them have sent. I need to go to the package that's over there. Don't really know what's in here, but I think this is like kind of a mystery one. There's a few ones in here. Just pull one out here. There's this short black one. Um, 
crowtail worms. Longer black ones. That's really long. Big, thick, black. <sighs> um, got a few of these black ones. Then I got this lighter colored one that's long and black. Then I believe got this purple looking long black one. But some of those in there. Um, just let me put it back in the package here. I really like these power bait um, packages because they seal right up and they're so easy to open. All you have to do is just open the flap and you just peel. That's how easy it is. Really easy to close. One thing I don't like about the yum packaging is when you tear it, it's right at the seal. So like I have to like find the seal or where the they come apart. I'm, I'm okay. I'm gonna start trying to open this one. There you go. There you go. That was actually pretty easy, but a bit harder to close to. Um. Next, I will again with the power bait worms. I got two types of worms in here. Um. Really easy to open, guys. I love them. I got these. What's the name of them? Trying to look for the color pumpkin seed. Not sure. Yeah, this is the pumpkin seed ones. Um, I love using these Texas rig them. Uh, they're perfect, guys. The color is just perfect. Well, oh, <clears throat> looks like pumpkins. Pumpkin seed. That yeah. they're called pumpkin seeds. So, um, got a, I've never lost one. Fishies a little bit. Um, these green ones, <clears throat> these are called watermelon. I love the watermelon color way. So I just picked these up too. I think a little bit murky water. But, seal this back up. So easy to seal up, guys. The seal is big. Next, we got these, um, little toads. Forgot the name of them. Top water toads. I need to buy more of them. Don't have a lot. It's kind of an empty package right now. You zoom. Okay, that's a little bit weird. I can't open it. There we go. First, we got these white toads here. I know the name of them. I just can't think of the name right now. But man, I love these white ones. That's why I don't have as much. I've actually got three in total. Next. I only have one of these things here, but the water, they're not going to be really seeing the top part, guys. Just want you to know that, guys. If you think about it, um, top water. Think of top water. You see, the design's all cool, but I think I have a top water thing, right? Yep. Okay, I've got a top water spook here. Look at the top and the head. The design is so cool, you know? Um, but they're really seeing. Is the underbelly clear underbelly? That's all they're gonna be seeing because it's on top bar. So, but it's translucent on the bottom, so it might see the blue on top. You won't really know, but yeah. So they're gonna be seeing this orange belly here. You can't really tell. It's a little bit orange, orange green, darker in the middle, kind of lightens out, then comes to the green. Then we got these. They're called rivet frogs. I'm pretty sure. Ribbit frogs swim. You got these swim things here. Um, really good. Love to fish them. So yeah, guys, that's gonna be the end of the video. All my soft plastics. Really long video. I'm sorry for that, but um, see you guys in the next one. Bye.